Hey there, did you ever go to bed with the perfect skin the night just before an important meeting or even before a date? And then when you woke up the next morning, your face is covered with the most horrible acne? We all have been there. But luckily, today I'm discussing how to get rid of acne and how to prevent this from ever happening to you again. Let's get started. So welcome back to How to Medicate and in this video we're going to discuss how to get rid of acne. Now before we start let me quickly introduce myself. My name is Raoul, I'm a medical doctor from the Netherlands and I'm making weekly medical videos to educate myself as well as you my viewer because I believe that medically educated people make healthier decisions and that's what this channel is all about. This video also comes with a quick disclaimer, it's meant purely informative, this is not medical advice and if you're looking for medical advice always contact your own doctor. Now before we start discussing skin care and treatment, it's important you know what acne is. Acne or acne vulgaris in Latin is a skin disease which is caused by clogging of skin cells and skin oil called sebum in a hair follicle. Hair follicles are the complexes in which hairs grow and once the follicle is blocked this can lead to inflammation by bacteria in your skin oil and ultimately this can cause acne. And most often acne is caused in these parts of our skins with the most oil glands. These are our back, chest and our face. It's mostly seen in teenagers, but it can persist throughout a whole adulthood, which is not fun. Now, the most contributing factor to acne is our genetics. It causes about 80% of all cases, but my mother always told me it was the fries and burgers I was eating. Maybe your mother tells you the same, but this is not based on medical evidence. In fact, the role of our diet, as well as smoking cigarettes, on the development of acne is still unclear. However, sweating heavily, putting on a thick layer of makeup and squeezing our spots do contribute to the causation of acne. And lastly, acne can vary a lot. It can be mild to quite extreme, with small to big pimples, which can be red, big and cause scars. And ultimately, acne can contribute to a low self-esteem, anxiety and in extreme cases, even a depression. So don't underestimate acne. Now we know what acne is, we definitely know we want to decrease our chances on ever getting it. And this is your step-by-step -step plan. First of all, wash your face twice a day with lukewarm water, use mild soap to gently scrub, and lastly, pat your skin dry with a clean towel. Try to use only water-based skin products which are also fragrance-free. These are the least likely to clog your hair follicles. Next up, don't use oil-rich creams or ointments directly on your acne, as this may prolong its duration and lastly, it could also help to change your pillowcases more often, as these soak up all the bacteria and oils of your skin. And we end off this video by taking a look at the available treatments for acne. Here it's important to note that the severity of the acne determines the available treatment. Start off by perfecting your skincare treatment. As this is insufficient, your doctor might prescribe you benzoyl peroxide or a local retinoid like adapalene. This is suitable for mild acne. If this is insufficient, your doctor might combine these drugs with a local antibiotic. The next step is switching the local antibiotic for an oral antibiotic. And when dealing with very severe acne, the last treatment option is switching an oral antibiotic and benzoyl peroxide or an oral antibiotic and a local retinoid for isotretinoin, also called Accutane. I will make a video on all of these drugs and tell you exactly how and when you should use them. You can find a link to these videos in the description or somewhere up there. Which brings us to the end of this video. I hope you now know how to get rid of your acne and let me know if it worked in the description. If you want to keep continue learning then check out the playlist in the description and make sure to leave this video a like. This helps out the channel tremendously and consider subscribing as well. This will help me to reach my new subscriber milestone, 10,000 subscribers. Thank you for watching and as always I will see you next week. Bye bye.